Hey guys, I'm Bronson and I want to tell you a really cool theory I have about booster packs and Flesh of Blood and how I think that they're going to seed them into specific types of cards into specific types of packs. Now, I want to first talk about how I thought about this idea and then I'll go into the idea itself. So I was watching an interview recently with James White and he was talking a lot about the Monarch product and the big key thing that I took out from this interview was that the draft experience was going to be so much better. It was going to be the best that it's ever been. And I was thinking, how can it be even better? Like, what would have to happen in order for the experience of draft to be better? And when I thought about that, I looked at the Blitz for format. It's a new format that came out for Flesh and Blood fairly recently, maybe maybe two months ago. And James had also said that they have been preparing for this. Whatever's happening in, in next year, in 2021, they've been preparing for this along the way. And, and they've set up all the groundwork in order for this to be a success. And what I think is going to happen is they are going to create specific booster packs so that when you are drafting you can open a certain amount of packs and get all the cards you need in order to create a deck and then play in that draft format now the biggest kind of evidence that i have with this is if you look at the blitz format there's 11 equipment side pieces that you can have to add to your character depending on what matchup you're against for instance if you're going against a wizard or a rune blade you're going to want some arcane barrier uh what is it equipment so you can block all that damage and if you're not then you don't get arcane barrier so i feel like they're creating a format where you can mix and match equipment on your hero and even though that's kind of a thing, I still thought it was weird. I still thought it was weird that y that you could like sideboard that stuff and th that's what they were focusing on. And it really came down to what I was thinking is like, well, maybe they're thinking of creating like a pack just for equipment. And then I thought about it. Hey, what if they create a pack just for hero card? It's a hero class card. So you have the hero and a hero weapon and then just hero like class specific like you have to be a guardian in order to play this card you have to be a brute in order to play this card and you have a pack of that and if you map it all out it really would be an awesome draft experience can you imagine like you get like a hero class card pack you get equipment card pack you get an action card back you get an other and you get like maybe five six packs in total right open them all up and you can literally take your hero class cards and like instantly add them to your deck. Your equipment cards, that can all be on your sideboard because it's it's. I think you can have 11. So there's maybe a couple you have to discard. And then your actions and other ones. Those, I think, will have to be where you have maybe 50 that you open in a pack. But then choose 40 of them that you want to play with or something along those lines. And I really think that... This is going to happen in the future. Is it going to happen with the Monarch product in 2021? I don't know. I, I think it's, it's, it's a chance. And this could be what James is referring to when he's talking about increasing the scope of the game and making it a fun draft experience. I think that this, is, this would make a really fun draft experience. Basically having it all set up for you where you don't have to dig through each pack and and have draft be a little weird weird trying to find out what what's what and and doing it that way if you have seeded packs that only have certain types of cards it's going to make drafting a lot easier now i want to leave it off with this is just a theory and i i don't know if this is going to happen or not i do think it will happen in the future but yeah, let me know. Thanks for watching.